a very good morning to all the student of class second dear student today we will discuss the 13th chapter of social science that is parts of plants from the book our land our world so dear student let's begin with the chapter dear student in the beginning of the chapter you should know what are the learning objectives of the chapter a student as the chapter title is itself describing the learning objectives we will learn about the parts of plants and the functions of their parts so let's begin with the chapter parts of plants dear student plants can be found in water desert plain and mountains plants aapko kahin bhi mil sakte hain but all these plants have common parts lekin ye jo sare plants hote hain inke kuch common parts hote hain so let's discuss with these one dear student here i am sharing my screen with you this is a picture of a plant as you can see in my screen this is the picture of a plant the part of plant above the ground is called its shoot this is very important question what is shoot of plant the part of the plant above the ground is called its shoot this is the shoot which is above the ground as i am describing it as a arrow this is the above ground the shoot has branches leaves buds flower and fruits these are the shoots flowers flowers buds branch leaf and fruit the part of plant under the ground is called its root what is root which is under the ground is called root of the plant each part of the plant has a special job bachcho jo bhi plant ke part hote hain sabka apna apna hai काम होता है लेट्स डिस्कस विथ दिस वेरी फर्स्ट वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट रूट roots hold the plant firmly into the ground roots absorb water and mineral from the soil so what is root roots are basically under the ground roots absorb water and mineral from the soil बच्चों जो रूट्स होते हैं वो खनिज पदार्थ और पानी कहाँ से लेते हैं मिट्टी के अंदर से लेते हैं वो मिट्टी के अंदर ही ग्रो करते हैं सम रूट्स लाइक कैरेट एंड वीट रूट स्टोर फूड वी ईट देम एज अ वेजिटेबल बेसिकली कैरेट एंड वीट रूट आर द एग्जांपल ऑफ रूट्स एज यू कैन सी इन माई screen this is the picture of carrot and this is the picture of beetroot the next one is stem stem is the main support of the plant on the ground stem kya hota hai tana kya hota hai kisi bhi plant plant ka support system hota hai some stem like that of mango are thick and strong and woody they stand themselves jo mango tree hota hai uske stems kaise hote hain 
ठीक होते हैं स्ट्रॉन्ग होते हैं एंड बुढ़ी होते हैं और वो खुद से बिना किसी सपोर्ट के सीधे खड़े रहते हैं सम स्टेम्स लाइक दैट ऑफ बनाना आर थिक एंड सॉफ्ट बट स्टैंड ऑन देयर ओन सपोर्ट कुछ स्टेम्स होते हैं जैसे जो बनाना के स्टेम्स होते हैं वो थिक होते हैं सॉफ्ट होते हैं लेकिन वो क्या होते हैं खुद से खड़े होते हैं उन्हें खड़े होने के लिए किसी भी सपोर्ट की जरूरत नहीं होती है सब स्टेम्स लाइक दैट ऑफ मनी प्लांट आर सॉफ्ट एंड वीक कुछ प्लांट्स होते हैं लाइक मनी प्लांट जिसके स्टेम्स होते हैं सॉफ्ट होते हैं लेकिन वो काफी वीक होते हैं दी नीड सपोर्ट टू स्टैंड उनको खड़े होने के लिए सपोर्ट की जरूरत होती है सो दिस दीज आर दी एग्जाम्पल ऑफ स्टेम दिस इज द मैंगो स्टेम दिस इज द बनाना स्टेम एंड दिस इज द मनी प्लांट स्टेम सो द मैंगो स्टेम्स आर स्ट्रॉ वुडी एंड दे स्टैंड बाय दम सेल्फ दिस इज द बनाना स्टेम विच आर सॉफ्ट and thick and but they stand on their own support this is the stem of money plant they are weak and they need support to stand stem carries water and minerals from roots to all other parts of the plant so what is the use of stem in the plant stem carries water and minerals from the roots to all other parts of the plant stem ka kya use hota hai wo water aur mineral root se jad se leke sare plant ke parts mein pahunchate hain what is the role of stems in the plant this is very important question stems carries water and minerals from roots to all other parts of the plant the stem carries food prepared by leaves to all other parts of plant so i am highlighting these things number 1 stem carries water and minerals from roots to all other parts of the plant the second one is the stem carries food prepared by leaves to all other parts of the plant so basically this is the role of stem in the plant stem of some plant like sugar cane and potato store food we eat them this is the stem of sugar cane and this is the potato the next one is leaves let's discuss the leaves leaves of nearly all plants are green aapne jaise dekha hai sabhi ki pattiyan kaisi hoti hain green hoti hain leaves are the food factories of the plant leaves kya hoti hain plant ki food factories hoti hain this is very important question which is the food factory of the plant plant so the answer is leaves are the food factories of a plant i am highlighting it leaves are the food factory of the plant they change water and carbon carbon dioxide into sugar in the presence of sunlight wo kya karte hain pani aur carbon dioxide ko suraj ki presence mein sugar mein convert karte hain plant give of oxygen in the process aur is process mein plant kya dete hain oxygen dete hain aur oxygen hamare liye kaise hamare liye oxygen ka kya use hai we breathe oxygen to leaves 
to breathe and oxygen to live. This is very important question. What we need for the breathe? So answer is we breathe oxygen to live. What we need for live? We need oxygen to live because we breathe oxygen. This is the picture of leaves. This is the pictorial part of leaves. The next one is fruit and flowers, which is again very important part of plant. Grown up plant bear buds. This is the pictorial part of buds. Buds change into flowers. Basically, buds kise kehte hain? Jo aadhe khile hue phool hote hain. Buds change into flowers. Flower is the most beautiful and soft part of the plant. Sabse sundar aur sabse soft part plant ka kya hota hai? Flower hota hai. Flowers change into fruits. Flower kis mein change hota hai? Fall mein change hota hai. Most fruits have seeds inside them. Bohut sare fruit aise hote hain, jinke andar unke beej bhi hote hain. Seeds can again grow into similar new plant. So, jo wo beej hote hain, wo fir se isi plant ko jan dete hain. Yehi plant paida karte hain. So, this is all about the flowers and fruits. So, dear student, in the last, let's have a relook. Let's revise the chapter 13 parts of the body. This is a quick revision of the chapter. This is the pictorial part of the plant. The part of plant which is above the ground is called shoot. I am highlighting it. The shoot has branches, leaf, buds, flower and fruit. The part of the plant which is under the ground is called root. Each part of the plant has a special job to do. So let's discuss with this one. Very first, let's discuss root. Root hold the plant into the ground. Root absorb water and minerals from the soil. Some root like carrot and beetroot store food. We eat them as a vegetable. Basically, carrot and wheat root are example of roots. The sec second one is stem. Stem is the main support of the plant which is above the ground. Some stems like mango are thick, strong and woody. Some stems like banana are thick and soft but they stand with their own support. But some stems like money plant are soft and weak. They need support for the stand. Stems carries water and mineral from root to all other parts of the plant. The stems carries food prepared by leaves to all other parts of the plant. This is the role of stems. Stems ka kya role hai? Wo water or minerals ko root se collect karke pure plant mein le jata hai. The stem carries food prepared by leaves to all other parts of the plant. Jo patiya food pre prepare karti hai, stem kya karta hai? Usse baki sare parts mein, baki sare plant ke parts mein pohunchata hai. Stem of some plant plants like sugar cane and potato store food. We eat them. The next one is leaves. Leaves of nearly all plants are green. Sabi plants ki patiya mostly green hoti hai. 
leaves are the food factories of the plant they change water and carbon carbon dioxide into sugar in the presence of sunlight kya karte hain sunlight ki presence mein wo water aur carbon dioxide ko sugar mein convert karte hain plant give us oxygen in this process who gives us oxygen plant gives us oxygen this is very important who gives us oxygen so plant give us oxygen we breathe oxygen to live what we need for live we need oxygen to live so the last one is flower and fruits grown up plant bear buds buds change into flower flower is the most beautiful and soft part of the plant flower change into fruit most of the fruit have seed inside them bahut se phal aise hote hain jiske andar uske beej hote hain aur wo beej fir se wohi naya paudha banate hain so this is all about the chapter 13 which is parts of the plant so dear student in our next lecture we will discuss the 14th chapter of the social science thank you